Hey there, Internet. How's it going? John from John Grave Show. And today, we're talking about the Xbox One. Yeah, the Xbox One sold a million, million copies. I applaud those guys, man, for basically making they, the all-in system. You know, that, that they got all the um, support that um, they had, and everybody's out buying one, and they are enjoying it. Or I would say that they could enjoy it solely because um, the, X, the Xbox One, now this is like... Uh, the still in like 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 his launch phase. The X, the Xbox One owners um, or the Xbox One uh, holders in the UK are having problems with it, mostly because it's not um, working with their TVs. Apparent uh, apparently, uh, people um, who use um, uh, TVs from either Freeview version or Sky uh, um, or Sky TV users. They can't. Uh, they can't use it mostly because the HDMI output, the out, the output port, uh, the pass, the pass through port is jittery and it sends unwatchable, watchable video, mostly because the uh, system itself defaults back to uh, 60 frames per second, and most of the um, programming up in the um, on British TV or in UK's um, uh, television programs, they go at um. They go at 50 hertz, so basically it kind of forces itself to try and uh, it forces it to try and be at 60, but but uh, it can't. So most of the video pro um, uh, feeds are so um, uh, they don't uh, they don't mesh well. So that's where the terrible video is come coming from. In terms of this, I mean, like in light of that, there are some um, all this. All this information right here. See, I can understand like it having problems like this. I said this in my last video, or at least my Xbox box box video, that stuff like this is bound to happen. Most mostly because the system is still new, still fresh out of the box, and things such as this are just sort of like, well, yeah, it comes with the territory of them planning for one end and not the other. I'm pretty sure that they can like patch this up and just go ahead and just go about their day. Just have it so that the UK users or maybe the American users or wherever can download it, and then then it can be adjustable to where uh, to where you live at. It's no big deal. Thing is, though, is that um, is that I get the feeling that stuff like this, people really are gonna like hold this against the system for like longer periods of time, mostly because. This is like this is like the biggest feature that um that uh, Microsoft was, was uh, talking about and was showing off was like yeah um we're basically the ones that's all about like family entertainment we're all about TVs we're all about you know you can do things with with your family and for what uh, and for my knowledge it all works thing is though is that when it's not working for the people over in the UK it's kind of like it's kind of leaving a sour taste in their mouth. Mostly because a lot of people went out, went out, went out and bought it for simply that reason, or they just like Xbox better. Either way, that's what they did. In terms of them fixing this problem soon, I kind of, I kind of see them fix, fixing this this problem up uh, within the week. Mostly because some people will actually kind of take this like way out of um uh, proportion and try and like use this as ammunition to like burn down Microsoft and say that Sony is king or something. Eh. Yeah, whatever. Let me know. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section, please. Please, do you think that this is gonna um uh, that this is a terrible problem, or do you think that eh, it's not all that big of a deal and Microsoft's gonna have it patched in like a week? <laughs> let me know. Hey, but uh, until then, please rate, comment, it, rate, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching the video. Hey, the internet, how's it going? You know who I am, and I'm uh, and I have a proposition for you. If you go uh, down to the little uh, description bar, you'll find a link to this little book right here. It's called Mizuki Dragon Wars. It's a pretty good book. You know, everybody who's read it has loved it and everything. So, yeah, go ahead and pick it up and give it a nice read, all right? Have a great day.